In a 19th century lab at Gießen, a young chemist wonders why fertile fields grow tired, and a wooden barrel with uneven staves rolls into view as a riddle. Eustace von Liebig challenges the humus theory, showing that plants take carbon from the air as CO2 and hydrogen and oxygen from water, while the soil's job is to supply mineral nutrients. In 1840, his book ignites the idea of replenishing soils with artificial mineral fertilizers, but an early 1845 patent manure fails because its insoluble minerals resist rain yet remain unavailable to roots. Liebig's law of the minimum says yield is limited by the scarcest nutrient, so even abundant NPK cannot help if, say, magnesium is the shortest stave in the barrel. Mineral fertilizers spread and raise harvests, but overuse washes nitrate and phosphate into waters, fueling eutrophication and low oxygen dead zones. Leaching depends on rate, timing, soil, and weather, so misapplied nitrogen escapes to groundwater and streams, accelerating algal blooms and degrading water quality. Phosphate fertilizers can carry cadmium and other toxic metal and metalloids that accumulate in topsoil over decades and may enter the food chain. Today's answer is 4R nutrient stewardship. Right source, right rate, right time, right place. Often guided by precision agriculture to feed crops efficiently with fewer losses. The moral of the barrel, feed the field what it lacks and only as much as it needs, turns chemistry into stewardship. Like, share and subscribe for more such stories from Aesop's favorite.